Screw you, rock music. I don't go. Know if I like this game or I hate it. it. Get away from me, you mangy animal. Good God. Dong! What's up, everybody? It's like that's Ann. Tingra back again for more Starbound. Let's play this game together. Our melon seeds have not grown yet. I put melons up there. Quite a few things, quite a few things. This is actually, as I am recording this, it is the December 11th update. They had another update. They're updating this game like crazy. Like, seriously, these guys are really on the ball. This is why I was talking about these guys are on the ball. Cube World was not. But anyway, anyway, anyway. A couple really exciting things and a couple new fixes. Uh, they don't wipe our character anymore. However, we would have to create a new character in order to get some of the new features. Uh, the only one that was actually pointed out specifically in the change log is apparently we're invincible within our starship. And I guess technically right now we haven't been invincible. I don't really know what could actually kill you unless it was an error player or something. I don't know. But I've done quite a few things and I also figured out how to run a multiplayer server. So that said, I think maybe after this episode I will start a new character for all the new fixes. And open up the multiplayer server, dump all of this guy's stuff in a chest or something like that. I, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. You know, maybe I'll figure out a way that I can actually transfer my items from one character to another or something like that. But anyway, exciting news today. Today we get... Oops. Today... There. I found a lot of really cool stuff while I was digging on the desert planet. One is this cool sword, which looks like it's from Dark Cloud. Uh, I haven't really tested this thing out. It's not a bad weapon by any means, but it's not necessarily good compared to our shotgun sledge boner hammer. But it's got that fog to it, and its attack speed is a lot faster. Yeah, so maybe I'll have to test it out. It looks badass, though, that's for sure. Really organic type of weapon. Also, I ended up finding a crap ton of ore. We actually have enough diamond now. To make ourselves a diamond pick. So I'm excited for that. Where is it? Where, where, where? Oh, what's that? <gasps> Lantern. Aha. Okay, so maybe we don't need to start a new character. Because it seems like this is a new craftable recipe. And it seems like all of these things got improved upon and added to the game. And they're still on this character. We don't need to create a new character for anything besides being invincible in our ship. Which isn't a problem because we're not playing multiplayer yet anyway. But that's kind of cool that they let us craft lanterns. That costs a little too much to craft a lantern, but uh, maybe they'll have to fix that. Yeah, I mean, even a bow costs less than a lantern. Oh, there's supposed to also be backpacks we can craft that I'm not sure what category they're under, but it's supposed to be so we can actually light up caves and stuff like that. Not to mention more balancing for most of the weapons. Aha! Our hunting knife has gone back to a one-handed weapon instead of two. Okay, so they're really on the ball, aren't they? They're really balancing everything. Also, birds are not supposed to be nearly as overpowered as they were. But anyway, let's make ourselves a beautiful... Look at this gorgeous thing. Diamond pick. Yeah, baby! Look at this thing! It's blue! Abadia Abadai, and it is gorgeous. Also, I put all of our health things and stim packs in here. Blue stim packs make us jump a lot higher. Red stim pack heals health. But we don't need it because we got our stuff. We got Molotov cocktails, too. I'm excited to use those. Now, let's see if there's any... Is it under clothes? No. Okay, what about cooking? Anything new in here? No, not that I can tell. What about on a crafting table? Anything? Anything at all? Anything? Doesn't look like there's anything new. Unless I just missed it. Die. Sandstone blocks. A cell table, which we actually found that blueprint a long time ago. I don't know where we get cell matter, though. I think it's an underground biome. Same with the cell materia. It must be. It must be something that we find underground, because uh, where I actually found these blueprints was inside an underground biome that was a cell biome, or whatever you want to call it. But anyway, not today, but I do want to craft ourselves a distress beacon. Uh, I've actually been looking... Ooh! Nicely done. I suggest you gear up before placing it. <laughs> yeah, right. You never know who will receive your signal. Now, this thing actually spawns our first boss, which the first boss is 
a penguin UFO thing and it's really cool and beautiful and stuff but I was actually looking on some other people's series and they seem to be very easy to kill yes <gasps> actually I don't exactly know why I warped down here we're probably going to end up getting off world let's see ow get out of here you stupid monster I gotta turn my volume down holy crap aha see look they didn't stay angry at us nearly as long. Come here, you little, you little bugger. I, whoa, whoa, and we one shot them again. That's great. Huh. Oh, 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 we nailed one. Yes, yes. But yeah, so there's not really anything else on this world. So honestly, I think we can get out of here. I think so. Bzzz. I think it's time for us to go off world. Oops! I was supposed to be getting a crap ton of plant fiber off camera, but I didn't actually end up doing that. Bong! Test your might. Dun 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 dun! You know, Mortal Kombat. Let's close the gate here. Let's go to another world, baby. Okay. Our home world's over here. That's over here. Oh, that's that desert. That's the desert planet that we can never visit again. Can't land. Desert. Moon? <gasps> a moon? Should we go to a moon? What's over here? Ooh, a snow planet. Should we go to a snow planet? We got all our snow stuff. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. While we're sitting in the cockpit here, I'll get a cool angle. I don't know what's with the frame rate, by the way. Maybe it's just because of all the things they keep adding and stuff. I don't know. But either way, bloop. Bloop! Oh my god! Whoa! Yes! To another world! All over again! And I know we already wasted. Well, not wasted, but we already took like almost five, six, seven minutes already <laughs> explaining stuff, but hey, that's how it goes. So, anyway, yes! Flying into the future! Yes! Let's, let's do this! I've never. I've. I've experienced a snow biome once, and, and I've only screwed with it a little bit. Oh man, that hurts my eyes. I've only screwed with it a little bit, but I I think, bong, we are here, everybody. Man, this place is cluttered, isn't it? Yeah. Now, oh, another thing I want to mention too. Actually, as I was testing stuff out with the other races, it's really awesome. If you haven't already seen other people's let's plays, but it's like. Uh, I've also tested it myself. Each character, like each different race, has a different UFO. They have different starting clothes and they all look different and everything. And even their armor, like scavenger armor, is human exclusive. Otherwise, the other races get their equivalent of this armor. But... What is that? Res what is that? The iron armor is favored by lone humans uh, scratching out an existence among the stars. What is that top resistance? Lightning trade or oh is that a shield? I gotta find out what all those pictures mean. It's not self-explanatory enough. But hell! Ooh! Well we came here at night, so we can't really experience it for what it truly is. I don't want to accidentally place that, so I'm putting it in our inventory. But uh-oh. Bats! Get out of here! Get out! Did we nail one of them? Nope. Okay. Uh, let's... Oh, you know what? Gotta take our torches off of there so that the inventory counts as having them. Create a campfire. And we are already all set because this area... Get... Put it down! There we go. What is this? <gasps> Ice! Yes! Now, one of the things that's actually really cool about the snow biome... Wow, I'm really gonna have to go and get plant fiber. This was the worst decision ever to come here. Are you evil? Get out of here! Get out! But yes! Ugh! Come on! But yes! We need plant fiber! So that we can actually freaking heal! Now, I'm pretty sure when you cut down these trees... As I was saying, the this is just as fast as the desert as far as digging goes. And yes, the trees don't give wood. That's what I remember. Uh-huh. Now... Should we start, should we start underground and then work from there? Those bones aren't hitting him, that's weird. Oh, there we go, stupid creature. 
Dig, 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 dig. I also don't know if we're gonna be digging super fast just because, you know, <sighs> because we're using our diamond pick. Isn't that just gorgeous? I want to try this dark cloud living sword thing. Hit him with the smoke. Well, it didn't one shot him, but its attack speed is tremendously awesome. I'm going to have to find out where those backpacks are, those craftable backpacks, because apparently they emit a light source. Actually, you know what? Let's see. Ah, it doesn't seem like there's anything. I mean, maybe we would get the resource from the atomic anvil or whatever it's called. Are you evil? Oh, they weren't. Well, they're dead now. I like how that ice water didn't even hurt us. Yeah! Ooh! I mean... Yes! Let's dig our way through here. Let's just go. I want to experience the caves. Actually, you know what? We should probably check the surface, shouldn't we? Whoop! Can we get out of here? Can we get out? Yeah! I think let's experience the surface until it gets to nighttime, maybe. Or maybe... Hmm... Hmm... We'll see. Wow! Gadzoops, you little dog! Oh, and by the way, another thing that was, uh, they changed in one of the patches a long time ago was that, uh, really early on, actually, the starting planets near you could actually be up to threat level 10 and stuff like that. They've since changed that a while ago, where all these planets are going to be threat level 1, so we're going to be able to handle all of them easy as pie. Wow! Well, that was easy. Where's my easy button? Jeez. I want to find something cool. I want to find something really cool. Come on. Give me something cool. Man, this pick is gorgeously awesome. By the way, I saved some diamond ore just in case this thing starts getting on in years. Because we want to, you know, try to keep this thing alive as long as we can. Because, isn't that exciting? The next thing that we're going to actually be mining with is probably going to be like some kind of a drill or laser or something. Ooh, gold! I'll take that. Get inside my inventory and stop giving me bad frame rate. Yes. Stop it! Stop it! But we're getting pretty close to our commercial break. So that's why I'm kind of just going right now. We'll just see if we run into anything cool. Otherwise, I will probably continue onward off camera and see if I can run into anything sweet and beautiful and... Uh! Take that. And just awesomeness indeed. Hopefully that will also give this world a little bit more time to load in. What is that? Oh, it's just more friggin' ice. Icicles. <gasps> Death to the heathens. <laughs> That's what you think. Take my boners. Yeah. Come here. Take that, stupid. He gave us a yellow stim pack and <gasps> there's a treasure chest. I mean, I get it. After we kill his dogs. Those are more into actually his dogs. Anything cool? Anything cool before the commercial break? <gasps> Another legendary weapon. Star Killer. Another two-handed beautiful thing. This one actually looks badass. Whoa! Whoa! Its attack speed isn't that good. Its damage is really crappy too, actually. I wonder if this is supposed to be like a very noob item. You know? Now let's see what else we got. That is garbage. A spear. That is garbage. We're gonna take the money, we'll take the tomatoes, and I will take the chest. Also, let's take all this cool stuff too. Yeah, cause this diamond pick makes this easy. Yes indeed. Man, I love the music in this game. That I think is one of the other biggest appeals of this game to me. I think that's one of the other reasons that I'm so addicted to it. It's just the soundtrack is just awesome, you know? It really is. Yes. But anyway, I'm gonna finish this up and then I'm going to run to the right and see if we can run into anything cool. Hopefully we will. Otherwise, we'll probably do a little bit of caving today and in the next episode, I think we'll take on the penguin spaceship thingamabob so that we can see about finding some new gear and stuff like that and yeah anyway i took care of that thing sooner than i thought but ooh, this diamond pick matches the ice that were is around us too but i'll see you all right after this welcome 
back, everybody. So, I didn't go that much further ahead, but I figured I would show off... Whoa, that was loud. I figured I would show off the fact that there actually are normal-ass trees. Whoa, frame rate! Easy there, buddy. <laughs> Jeez, and crackers, man. It's just, is it because we have our flashlight out? I wonder. You know what? I want to test out our explosive sword. <laughs> Well, it's not bad, but yeah, it's not nearly as good as our other weapon. I'm still going to save that for Infinity because I love the purple weapons. I wonder if there's going to be yellow gear. Is there? Like, there's probably better than purple. But I think that that is awesome that we're actually running into it so early on. That That's really good incentive to keep us playing. You know, and this, nothing can beat the boner. That's what this weapon's called. Go ahead, look it up. I don't have to hover over it. That's what it's called. It's not just an immature joke. <laughs> but anyway, yes, we are continuing onward on Hoth because that's what this planet is. Is there anything else cool over here? Stop it, frame rate. Stop giving me a bad time. Ooh. Hey, look. Ah. <laughs> Wait, what's the joke? What's the joke? It's like, it's like, Oh, look at that! It's two Jualda boys in the natural habitat! Oh no, they spotted us! Die! Whoa, those things hurt! I was actually trying to kill them. I was trying to sneak up and kill them. I thought they were going to be harmless creatures, but they're not. They're actually very deadly. Uh-oh. Huh. Take that! Even with the fad frame rate, I can beat you. Oh my god, this frame is horrendous! Well, if we ever need ice, we know where to look. This planet. What is all this? Is this copper? Man, there's a lot of copper around. We got plenty of it, though, and we sure as heck don't need it. Ooh. I'm not even gonna bother scaling that cliff, because we dig just as fast as we would scale it. Not really. It actually probably would have been a lot faster to go over it. Especially when we're going to end up similar to the top of it, but whatever. Bloop! Ooh! What's all this? What's all this then? Uh, I'll explore the rest of the sur- uh, Ah, let's explore a little bit more of the surface. Just a little bit. Just a bit. Anything cool? Anything special? Uh, Alright, we'll go into this cave then. Get out of here, you little pygmy dog thing. Bloop! Place down a torch. Whoa, easy there, frame rate. Easy. But I wonder if we're going to end up running into ugh, any unique, like, stuff. Anything? Anything special for an ice planet other than the ice itself? I don't know, man. Uh-oh. Whoa there, frame rate. Easy does it there, girl. It's not that hard to load, man. You've loaded harder stuff before. What's all this? Man, there's a lot of snow to this planet. I guess it makes sense, but wow. I really probably should have already gone around the planet rather than trying to dig right here, but whatever. Ooh. We actually get our torches back in one smack now. That's that's new. What's all this? I really should have taken that other cave. I really should have. Oh, there we go. Another cave. And the frame rate's going absolutely crazy. Holy crap. Dash across. Ooh. Is this silver or platinum? I think it's silver. Yeah. Silver and platinum look very similar. Uh, I wonder if they're actually going to change it. There are ways to tell. Because platinum has a white glow around it, kind of. Uh-oh. We're out of bandages. Oh, thank goodness. Well, at least we got some stim packs, so those will hold us off. Kind of in the meantime, in case we end up screwing ourselves over. Come here. Uh-oh. A weird dinosaur monster. Are we starting to get... Yeah, we're starting to get hungry. Nom, 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 I mean... Oh, there we go. That was close. I didn't know... I don't want to fall. Don't start doing frame rate issues while I'm hanging over a cliff. Freaking. Ooh. What is that? 
What is that? Is that just the equivalent to the stalactites? Slush. Okay. Oh, this is slush. Yeah, I think that was just the equivalent to the stalactites. Or is it stalagmites? Whichever ones are on the top that stab you. The stabby stabs. The rooftop stabbers. I want to be careful. Ugh. Ooh! I've never heard this song before. Yeah, I am very sorry about the frame rate, everybody. I really don't know what it is that this game is not cooperating with me today. Wow. Like, this is quite ridiculous. What is that thing? Is that a thing? Whoop. Is it? No, it's not. Oh. Well, anyway. Eh, eh. Easy. Easy. All right. We're doing... Stop! Stop! Seriously. Ooh, I really dig this music, man. This is really good snow music. They do a really good job, man. They did fantastic. Anyway, bloop! Let's light this place up. Ah, leap of faith. Even though it's just going over the... Whoop! Whoops! Oh, there we go. Okay, taken care of. Easy frame right? Slow down. I mean, blah, 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 blah. we were underwater. I didn't even notice. Yes, this is beautiful and I love the music. It very much reminds me of Donkey Kong and the epicness of it. No! Bad frame rate. I'm gonna have to find out if there's some. Ugh. I wonder if there's like a cache that I could clean or something. I hope so. Because this is ridiculous, man. Get out of here, weird monster. This place is crazy. At least we're getting a lot of money, which I think we're going to need once we actually take care of that penguin monster boss thing. Oh no, water. Oh, that was another thing that they kind of changed in the update too, is apparently lava is a whole lot more deadly. Not that we ran into lava that often. Well, not on camera anyway, but yes, it is now super deadly. So you gotta watch out for that. Dig! I wanna find something cool. I wanna find something new, hopefully. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm still excited as heck being on this planet in the first place. Because it's all snow and stuff. And it's a new adventure. Huh! And the music's really cool, too. But still, I really do hope that we actually. Is there going to be any new resources? I don't know. Maybe only near the core of the planet. In which case, I don't know if we'll actually get there today. Because this planet could be big, could be small. I honestly forget because I didn't check when we first landed. <gasps> Perfect! We ended up in the caves! Ugh! There we go. Ugh! I like this weapon a lot. I really do. I don't know if there's gonna be anything to top it for quite some time. Other than just finding something that's got raw damage to- Easy! Maybe it takes a lot more to generate the snow crap. Gee, sorry everybody. I, I really don't know what this game's problem is with me today. But then again, I've been running into constant computer errors today. So yeah, go figure. Ugh. Either way, it's still great. And thankfully we haven't needed to do anything particularly difficult. Like. If we were fighting a boss, then I would definitely have to stop recording and try to find some way to optimize this crap. Oh, great, I didn't even start my timer. Okay, well then you know what? I'll just go for five more minutes. Because that sounds that sounds about right, I think. I keep forgetting to start and stop my timer and stuff because, yeah. Is that platinum? I don't think it is. I want it though. Ooh, there's something lighting up, lighting up down there. But I still want to get all this coal because we need as much as we can for all of our ugh, space travel. Is it silver? Yeah, it was just silver. Well, still good that we found all the coal though because coal is... It's not that it's rare, but honestly, I don't find it nearly as much as the other ores. That could just be me though. Well, it's... There's something under the water that's lit, and lit up. I didn't actually try to do a dash there, but give me that gold. What is that that's down there? <gasps> <laughs> 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 
I don't know if that was anything, actually. Okay. Dig, 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 dig. <gasps> Perfect. We actually found something. What is this? Soft brick. Why is it? Why is there so much of it? It's like some kind of temple thing. We gotta dig our way in here. Even the diamond's having a little bit of trouble. Is this a dungeon? Where does it... Where? Where? I can kind of see it. Is this actually a cave system? This is weird, man. I think it l legit is a cave. Like, rather than an actual dungeon, I think this is a caving system. Like, like we found a special kind of underground biome or something, you know? I gotta dig our way into it, though, so we can actually start experiencing it. I also keep hearing weird goat noises. Are those, is that what the enemies are over there? Come on! Get in there! Come on! Dig faster! Why do we even... We have diamond, man. Yeah, this is a cave system because there's actually copper inside these walls. Huh. Okay, cool. And we found the beginning. At least of this little cave path thing. Well, if we ever need soft brick, you know where to look. Now, what is this? Ah, those are pots. Okay. The pots emit light? That's not bad. Ooh, I'm not gonna go for the coal if it's gonna be like that, though. Ha! Ah! Give me all that stuff! They got more stuff! Bloop! <gasps> Look! There's like little doll houses! What is this? Is this why the frame rate was having so much trouble? What is this thing? Oh, that's like a pot again. Really? Whoa. Oh, that look. Well, apparently they nerfed falling damage, so. Well, it kind of worked out because we actually landed in a puddle, which is actually what I planned. But this is the weirdest. Now, is there something special inside this biome, I wonder, that we could find? Because if there is, I'm probably going to have to find that off camera or something in the next episode, maybe? We'll, we'll see. But the... Whoa! Easy! Get over here, you damn monsters! What is all of this? This is such a weird place, man. I'm not gonna go down there because we're just gonna fall down and die. I wanna continue in here. I wanna see, is that platinum? I think that's platinum. Yeah, I think that's platinum. See how it's kind of lighter on the outside of it? If that's not platinum, then I suck at this game. Yeah, that's platinum, okay. So that we're actually going to stop and get, even though we don't technically need it now that we actually have our diamond pick. But I am still in the habit of it because platinum is rare, just like diamond is. So it's something that's good to have, that's for sure. Come on! Come on, baby! Oh no, we got... Come on, there we go. I want to explore more! Whoa. There's actually quite a bit of platinum. There's... I don't know if that's platinum, but there's some down there and stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do a lot of exploring in this area. This is where that double jump would sure come in handy. Yeah, it really would. Okay, well, you know what? Uh, I'm not exactly sure if I messed up my timer or if we're on the end of the episode here. But we're actually gonna call it here for today's episode, everybody. I'm gonna continue along in here and see if I can find something cool. And if I do, I'll be sure to put it on camera. But otherwise, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's episode and I hope you've been enjoying this series. Please be sure to like the video. I really would appreciate it and it helps me out more than you know. And if you want to see more in this series or any other of my videos, be sure to subscribe. Sign on, stay epic, everybody. Your face.